today I'm going to be talking about potentiometers. They are actually found in many places, like televisions or stereos, typically controlling the volume. They're usually built with a resistive element connected to two pins on either end of that element, and the center pin, which is connected to a wiper that you control with the knob. And uh, when it's set up as a voltage divider, you're changing the resistance resistors ratios so that you get a different voltage at the at the output of that voltage divider. Here on the bench I have a circuit set up to illustrate that a little more. Uh, I have two voltage dividers, one set up with resistors and one with a potentiometer. And um, before I get too far with any kind of measurements, always remember to take your components out of your circuit so that you're not measuring the resistance or impedance of the whole circuit, you're actually getting the reading from the components that you're trying to measure. So here I have two resistors adding up to a thousand ohms, so to 500 ohm resistors, and uh, so your output of your voltage divider would be half. And, and for the potentiometer, it is a 1K potentiometer. And it will vary between, oh, about 10, or 8 to 10 ohms, or 6 even, and on up to 1,000. So they're just about equivalent. And we can see that here in just a second when I run a signal through it. Um, for this circuit, I have a buzzer and an LED set up. And to get a good result, I'm going to change this to a square wave and turn it up so that we can see it and hear it better. Okay, so right now I have, this is the output of the normal resistor voltage divider. And when I turn the switch, it goes over to the and when I turn the switch, it goes over to the potentiometer, which I can just turn the knob and, and get a different output. So here's a close-up of the breadboard showing the potentiometer and the resistor voltage divider. I have a switch here to be able to go back and forth between them, a buzzer, and an LED to show the output. Uh, here is the output of the resistor set, and I can switch it over to the potentiometer where I can turn it to match the resistor, or much higher in this case, and anywhere in between. Just for clarity, I can pull that buzzer out, and then we can see the square wave going in and coming out, and have a cleaner look to it. Uh, if I work on this a little bit, I can make them, I can make the output of both voltage divider is just about exactly the same. Uh, and But the benefit of the potentiometer is that I can change the output of that almost infinitely without changing any components. So this has been talking about potentiometers. If you like the video, please hit like or comment or subscribe for more great content. Thank you.